Hello everyone, I'm uh, Average Log, share technology and share life. So today I will still uh, keep on sharing how to install the Google's GMS framework into your Huawei mobile phone, including all Huawei series uh, mobile, including Huawei Mate 30 Pro, Mate 30 and Huawei P30, uh, P30 and P40 Pro, all the Huawei uh, series. So if you want to use the Google, I mean Google Echoes, uh, systems uh, and uh, to want to install the YouTube app, YouTube, Twitter, Facebook and Google's uh, map, Google's uh, photos, such kind of uh, mobile phone on your mo Huawei series. So uh, uh, this uh, uh, this way of uh, install uh, the uh, Huawei's uh, Google's uh, framework is easy, simple and easiest way. There's no need to uh, reset your mobile phone or ch just into your factory mode, factory uh, reset to your factory mode. There's no need. I just give you the, uh, just uh, give you a semi, uh, a way of a simulate a mobile phone on your Huawei's original system. And today I also will uh, tell you how to install two systems, I mean, I mean simulate two separate uh, Android system, I mean, which including which uh, was included with the Google and Google GMS framework. One uh, one system is a Google Android 5.1 with a 32 uh, bit, and another one is a Google Android uh, th Android uh, 7.1 with a f uh, seven, uh, 64 bit. So with two ROM on your single VMOS to uh, simulate uh, Google's Android phone and which including the uh, Google's Play, I mean Google Google's Play and the Google's App Store, uh, all kind of that uh, framework, then you can very easily to install the um, apps which you want to use, including the Google Map, Google YouTube, such kind of uh, uh, apps. So, um, and I will show you step by step how to install this uh, Google, this VMOS simulator to simulate uh, Google original Google Android phone on your Huawei's mobile phone. It's very easy. I can assure you that it will be successful uh, in, on every Huawei phones. Um, yes. Okay. So now go to my mobile phone and I will show you how to do that. Okay. Let's go. Okay, now let's go to my mobile phone desktop. You can see this is my original system of Huawei's uh, EMUI systems. And I will, this is the original system. Then you can see I already uh, installed the VMOS Pro, this app. And uh, you can, I will show you how to use it. Then, uh, and then as uh, first step, I will show you how to use it. Then the second step, I will show you how to install this VMOS with the two dual system in one, uh, I mean, simulator. Okay, now I will uh, start the VMOS. Okay, launch this uh, application, then you can see there will be two system, two ROM on my, uh, in this uh, VMOS. You can see this ROM 5.1, which is Android 5.1, including the Google framework GMS. And another one on the right side is a uh, ROM 7.1, which is uh, the Android uh, 7.1 with uh, 64. 64 bit of the system. So there are the two versions. If you have in, if you want to uh, install install some app in, if you have any problem in the in the installation of or some some kind of app in the 5.1, then you can have a try the uh, 7.1. Maybe it can be fixed in the 7.1 because it is a more more latest I mean latest version of the Android phone. So there are two separate phones. So I will now start the 4.1, the Android version 4.1 of uh, Google uh, Android system. First, I will show you how it look like. Okay, play, press the button on the on the right bottom side play okay now play now this uh, android version 5.1 5, 5 is launching it said boot, booting up and the, and the bar which shows the uh, pro progress of the booting it's very fast you know now the huawei system which is very powerful so very fast just several seconds for uh, you can see this uh, there is a desktop of the android phone 5.1 you can see i already installed the play store google play store so uh, this or original, which already included the Play Store. There's no need to install this uh, Play Store manually. After you uh, install this application, it is it is already included in this system. Uh, okay, so, okay. You can see on the desktop, it's already included the Play Google Play Store. There's no need to manually install this uh, such kind of application. There's no need. You just click on the uh, Play Store. Here, then you can uh, search the application you want to uh, in, in install into your into your this uh, Android 5.1 system. Okay, I already uh, installed the Twitter in this uh, Android phone. Then you can uh, install the YouTube, Facebook, and uh, YouTube so, so, and Google Photo, all kind of uh, these uh, applications here. Okay, this is uh, one system. Then we can uh, go back to the original system. Okay, let's go back and uh, click this one. Then let's have a try the another one, 7.1. This version. Okay, let's play the start button. 
start and here you can see this is a pop-up uh, which said uh, if you want to run these two ROM together at the same time then you need to pay the pay the pay the money for this developer and for this company but I don't think there's no need to I think there's no need to pay the money you can just uh, switch to this uh, uh, for 7.1 and and switch off the 7.1 so previous one, there's no need to run these two ROM together. So there's no need to pay this money. So let's start at click the start. Okay, click the start. So the so now, now it is starting 7.1 to uh, boot up the 7.1. And the previous uh, 5.1 Android phone was closed, was uh, switched off. So it's okay. Now we can see this desktop is the uh, another uh, this 7.1 desktop. You can see I already uh, installed the YouTube and the Play Store. These two uh, YouTube. Uh, you can also install the uh, Insta, Instagram, and uh, you, YouTube, and uh, fo Google Photo, Twitter, something like that. Or very easy way to do that. Okay, you can see it's very easy to. You can see this app was uh, Google Play was uh, opened, and you can search the application and install just uh, at your fingertip. Very easy way to do that. Okay, this is very easy. So very easy to use. Now let's go back. This is the floating. Uh, just to minimize. Yes, and go back to my original phone. So now, next step, I will show you how to install this VMS with with two system in together in this uh, simulator, together with all of them with the uh, Google framework, Google uh, GMS framework, and all of them can install Google, YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, something like that. Okay, now I will uninstall this one. Uninstall to uninstall okay it was uninstalled now i will show you how to install this uh, simulator with two with dual system let's go to the chrome here you can see this uh, web address is vmos.com this is the uh, uh, address official i mean the official website of this uh, developer then you can download the vmos okay let's click the vmos pro download from this uh, official site vmos.com Okay, let's see, do you want to download again? Which means I already down downloaded this uh, app, so there's no need to download again. Okay, so I will click no need to download and click this uh, application to install this uh, VMOS. As you can see, this total size is 765 megabytes. It's uh, relatively uh, very big, but uh, which already included two ROM. Two ROM already included in this app. One is uh, Android Phone 5.1, and another one is Android Phone 7.1, and uh, which is the 64-bit uh, uh, system. Okay, I click install. Okay, now it is uh, installed. The version is 1.0, 1.1. Then, uh, okay, let's just wait. I think it's uh, very, very, very quickly because of now the, the smartphone. I mean, the uh, CPU is very strong, so it's very easy to do that. Okay, done. Let's go back to the desktop, okay, which was already installed. Now I will click VMOS to just load this application. Then there will be the uh, introduction 32 and 62, 64. If you have any problem between the, on the 632, then you can have a try 64. So vice versa, you can try these two system all together, okay? Now let's go to enter VMS Pro. Then it said uh, you needed to give some authority, you can no problem, one click first. Uh, set up the floating. It need a floating authority, just a floating ball, floating bar. It need allow the rec video record photo. You need, you need to allow those authorities and location. If you want to use the Google Map to uh, have you want to know your position, then you give this uh, allow this uh, authority and the photo and the file allow and record calls allow. Okay, now let's go to this face. This face is to select the ROM. So, okay, the first one is 7.2, 7.1, which is a 64 bit. The second one is uh, 5.1, which is a 32-bit, smaller, faster. So first, let's let's install this uh, uh, 5.1. Have a try, and the next step, we will in also install the 7.1 together, all of them. Okay, let's add, click add. Now it's uh, installing the 5.1, which is a 32-bit, so which is smaller and faster. So this is our first step, and uh, it's also very fast to install this uh, ROM. And uh, which is already uh, have this uh, Google's framework GMS, very easy way. Comparing with the, uh, I think the uh, another way is very complicated. From if you store on the ba I mean on the normal way, and I think the Google already uh, patched this. Uh, I mean this way. So I think now this way I show you this way is the most stable and uh, most easy way to install Google framework. Okay, now let's have a have a look. 
this. Uh, you can see now currently there's no uh, Google Play here, Google Play now. So we need to do one more setting, very easy setting on this uh, VM setting. Click this uh, button, this gray button. Okay, click. Then we go to the Google service, we just uh, click uh, enable the Google service. Okay, cannot close. Okay, let's confirm. So now it is uh, the Google service was enabled. Then let's go back and we switch off, switch off this uh, Android phone. Okay, now let's let's restart this Android phone. Then uh, now on this progress, it will for the Google framework in to make it available in this uh, Android phone. Then we will install the uh, Facebook, YouTube very easily. So now it is installing the uh, I mean the Google framework. Just wait uh, several seconds. Uh, it's very fast. So now it is installing the Google uh, framework. Just wait a moment. So. Uh, now uh, it's installed, but next time after it uh, installed the Google Play, then next time you boot this uh, Android phone, it's very fast. No need to waiting at the 99% this here. Now there's no need to wait here because now it is doing some original settings. Okay, let's go to the... Uh, okay, you can see this uh, um, application drawer, you can see it's here. Let's go to put here. And uh, now it's Play Store is already here, then you can click here. Play Store and sign in. Very easy, you sign in and uh, install the application you want. Okay, so let's go back to the home. Let's go back to minimize. And the next step, I will show you how to install another system. Seven point. Just click the uh, plus button on the right corner, right, bot right up corner on the screen. Click the plus button here. And select the 7.1 add. Click add to uh, install another system of 64 bit and click add click start and here click start not get it get it which means you want to pay the money for this uh, developer for this company but i don't think this no need i don't i don't think it need to pay the money so you can just uh, use single system at one time okay click start okay so now it's installing the uh, android 7.1 into your simulator, I mean VMOS, to have a due to system. Then if you have uh, any uh, application, you know, uh, problem, then if you have application problem in the Android 5.1, then you can switch off it and uh, switch it off. Then you can uh, switch on the uh, Android phone 7.1, have a try if it can be fixed in that uh, Android 7.1, because it is more uh, latest version of the Android. So it's uh, better, I, can, I think it's better uh, than the Android 5.1. Uh, okay, we already launched this uh, Android phone. You can see here, there's no uh, Google Play. Okay, now let's click VM setting on the bottom and the gray button. Then we click VM setting, enable the Google service, confirm, and uh, complete. And you can see Google service was enabled. You can see here, Google service was enabled. Okay, let's go back and uh, switch it off. And uh, switch it on again to uh, install to switch on and uh, to this system will install the google gms framework for this android phone uh, 7.1 64 bit then you can use google's application very easily so and uh, i think the speed is faster i think the speed is faster in in this uh android phone 7.7.1 7 .7 you can see the play store already there then you can put it on your desktop here okay so let's click this one and they can sign in, sign in to sign in this Google Play and install uh, this uh, all the uh, such kind of applications in the Google Photo, YouTube, very easy way, right? Okay, let's go back to the let's go back to the minimize. You can see here, then go back to your original phone. It's a very easy way. If you want to use uh, the Google service, Google service, Google's uh, photos, then you can go back to this uh, VMOS, VMOS, very easy way, right? So uh, thank you. If you think this uh, video is very is helpful and you can click thumb up to give me give me some support and uh, subscribe this channel to uh, to know more, to uh, see more videos. And uh, thanks for your watching and see you next time. Bye bye.